today I'm back with the remaining five simple basic principles of the why and how of setting financial goals. So let's just take a look at it. Number six, haste leads to waste. Wealth gained hastily will dwindle, but whoever gathers little by little will increase it. So, do not be hasty to increase your wealth. Trying to become rich will lead to poverty. So invest your money consistently and patiently little by little over a long period of time. Number 7. Be diligent in your work. Lazy people are soon poor. Hard workers get rich. So being content with what we have must not lead to slothfulness. Planning well and working diligently leads to prosperity. Number 8. God loves the cheerful giver. Do not withhold good from those who deserve it when it is in your power to help them. So God has given you money to share. Do not think twice about helping someone with money when you have it. When you give to the poor, you are not giving to God. You are lending to God and He will repay you even more. Number 9. Save money for a rainy day. The wise store up choice food and olive oil, but fools gulp theirs down. Always have a store of what you have so that they sustain you when there is a lack. Number 10. Avoid debt. The rich rules over the poor and the borrower becomes the lender's slave. Not be a man who strikes hands in pledge or puts up security for debts. If you lack the means to pay, your very bed will be snatched from under you. So you see, the Bible warns us of the harms of debt and what would befall if you are not able to repay. So be wise and set up your financial goals according to the Bible. And after watching this video, you might have got an idea of what will make you good stewards of your financial resources. Thanks for watching. Like and subscribe for more biblical economics.